for this game we find ourselves at the Adelaide Oval I'm paired in the box here today with Gary Lyon welcome Gaz thanks Otto it's great to be here taking the field tonight will be Adelaide and Western Bulldogs Converge for the toss of the coin. Adelaide kicking to the left of screen. Both sides look ready to get into the action just moments away now. We're underway at the Adelaide Oval. Taps it down. He gets his hands on the footy. Ball ends up with the opposition. Poscanelli grabs that one. Uses it now. Cannon slips high and gives away the free kick. Hardwick elects to kick. Good mark. And looks to send it back. Phillips kicks it. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Tips it towards half forward. Hoskinelli used the body to take that mark. Might be too far out to score. Going for goal number one. Almost the limits, but not quite. Grand missed an opportunity to mark. Teammates break for him. Hardwick takes the mark. Uncontested. Sinks the slipper into it. Picked up now. Just got the hands in the back there. Hipwood moves it now. Got the hands free. Gleason clinks up with a chance to run. Miller handballs out into space. My ball, says the umpire. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gas? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. Sicily just put it on the boot. He gets above the crowd. Western Bulldogs would love to make the most of this opportunity. 50 metres out. Going for goal number one. A great mark taken there. 10 metres out. Move it on. That kick was pure. Of course, huh? Dangerfield getting his first with that kick. His teammates rush over. Western Bulldog get the opening goal. Umpire ready to resume play. One it down. Opportunity for Franklin. Cochin lobs the handball. Didn't get away from the tackle. A great defensive effort. Hands it out to open space. Kerno has a teammate on the move. Door picks up the loose ball. Just put it on the boot. Sicily found some space and marked. Western Bulldogs are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beat in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. It's a foot race to get this one. He lays off the pass. Has a man running for him. Great mark. Fans crossing their fingers, hoping he can put this one through the big sticks. 
Going for goal number one. He sums up the situation and delivers. Yes, I know. They get around him after that effort. Adelaide kicked their first. Back in the middle. Has the rucks go at it. Phillips clears the contest. Brand just fends off his opponent. Handballs to a teammate on the run. Constricted by Greenwood. Brilliant chase. Puts it on the boot. Mops up the loose ball. It was always pushing that post. And pushing so hard. It's hit it. Now they lead by two. Deciding where to go with the kick-in. Plays on from the kick-in. Chose to kick it. Brand wins the ball in the air. Manages to get a hand to it. Hanley takes advantage. Receives the handball and takes off. Charges with intent. Goes short by hand. Palms won himself a free. Decides to kick. Gibb presents and takes the mark. Gibbs has resources out wide. Takes it well. Goes with the kick. Marking in space with others. Elects to kick. Chose to kick it. Bounces over the line. Palms now heading to the bench for a break. We'll get a ball in. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. He's got the football now. Taken by Cochin. Cousins going for number one. It just gets the journey, and it's a goal. Celebrating hard. Western Bulldog by eight points. We resume hostilities. Taps it down. The ball mopped up. Phillips, can he put it through? Looks like the ball will be coming back. A long driving kick. Brand with an easy mark. Uses it by foot. Strong mark in the contest. Moved on by Kurno. A clean pickup. Franklin just too high with the tackle. Wellick has a great set of hands. Moves the ball by foot. Paul gets the loose ball. The tackle slipped high and results in a free. Paul sets his sights on the goals. Goes with the kick. Does well to cut off the kick. Dale going for distance with the kick. He takes the mark. Looks to move it by foot. Hanley couldn't keep his hands on it. Is accepted. Sees off the tackler. Kicks hurriedly. Couldn't take it. Movement by hand. Weller gives it to the player running past. Paul might have overworked himself there. Cochin going for number one. Western Bulldog with the edge right now over Adelaide. Plays on. Puts boot to ball. Open opportunity for Akers. What did you make of the first turn, Gas? Western Bulldogs have come to play. They've got themselves in the game and need to push on now. What do you make of it all, Gaz? Adelaide are actually on top in the contested possessions. They just need to convert that dominance into scoreboard pressure. Thanks. Ready to go for the second turn. We're back in motion. Winning it was Grundy. Steele finds possession with the ball now. Intercepts the ball well. Hanley sends one up towards the wing. Kurnow puts it on the boot. 
Dugout box, Elwood gets the handball away. Gunston has the ball. Wow! How good was that? He puts through his first goal. Gets some reward for his efforts. Adelaide now only trail by three. Grundy thumped it clear. He wins possession. Clean pickup by Sinclair. No prior. Ball up in the centre square. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? This is a great game, Hutto. And you can just sit back and enjoy it. Narkel has it. Chips it towards half forward. Sinclair leaps over the top. Takes possession. A strong pack mark. A piercing kick for Brand. Stands tall and marks. Selwood wants to play on. Ends up turning this ball over. Goes by foot. Westhoff puts on a big hit. Hurried kick. Good mark there. Slams it on the boot. Silvanic had it, lost it. Fantastic tap. There'll be a ball up, close to goal. Clears the contest. Sicily collects the loose ball. Finding the ball was Cousins. Hannon there to mop up. I hope that's not serious. But boy, he looks to be in a lot of pain. Going straight to the rooms, doesn't look good. Grundy gets onto the ball. Quickly onto the boot. The ball over. Finds a way to go along the ground. O'Brien puts his first goal on the ball. Congratulated by his teammates. Western Bulldogs, but nine. Thumps it clear. Up for grabs for Cousins. Finds the loose ball. Beautiful tackle, Hutto. Picks up the loose ball. Just gets it onto the boot. Finds himself in space and marks. Marked by O'Brien. Putting this one through would give Western Bulldogs plenty of confidence. He gives it a run. A time to celebrate. O'Brien loved kicking that one. Western Bulldogs have kicked the last two goals. 15 points the difference. Grundy got a fist to it. He drives it. Houston got him high there. Good opportunity for Adelaide to put a goal through here. Miller lines up from long range. Westock wants to keep it moving by hand. He's got the footy in his hands. A chance for Robertson. He has the ball. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. That's right, Hutto. He just can't seem to get into the game. Gibbs hacks it out of there. A chance to reload the attack now. Hanley pumps the ball long. A race for the loose ball. Scoops up the ball. Simply outplayed his opponent. Rosie drives the kick. Scoops it up. Just handballs into space. Pushes through with power. First touch for Shields. Works it across the ground. Miller marks. 50 metres out. Going for goal number one. Doesn't take the mark. Ball gets cut off. The tackle deserves the free and gets it. Unable to create the space. Constant pressure and rewarded. He drives it towards goal. He loved that one. Adelaide close the gap to nine. Back in the middle now. Western Bulldogs go behind in the clearances, but are set up well enough defensively that it hasn't made a big impact. Western Bulldogs haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. 
Weller sends one up towards the wing. Sinclair marks that contested. Great mark under pressure. Sinks the slipper into it. Ball off hands. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. Hardwick kicks it. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Looks up with the kick. Good grab there for Brian. Uses it now. Hoskinelli with the mark. Pulling this one through would give Western Bulldogs plenty of confidence. Going for goal number one. He delivers with a drop pass. A time to celebrate. And don't they get around? Hoskin Elliott. The lead is now 15. Punches it clear. Is in his possession. Dishes it off. He has the ball. He couldn't hang on. And now we'll have a ball up. What can you tell us, Gaz? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. He makes that kick count. Full price. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. Adelaide behind by nine. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Adelaide just can't seem to retain possession of the footy. They're getting outmarked all over the ground and as a result find themselves losing this contest. Back in the half time and it's Western Bulldogs 33 to Adelaide 24. Western Bulldogs have had a good first half. I think they'd really love to stamp their authority on this contest in the second. What stands out for you, Gas? Adelaide need to be more efficient with their ball use. They've allowed the opposition too much influence from intercept marks. Thanks for that. Everyone takes a collective breath and we'll return with the second half. Second half action about to commence. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. With the ball is Delwood. Grundy gets the ball. A lot of possessions for him. Manages to get it onto the boot. Picked off the deck. Brings it out of the pack. Oscar Elliott gets on the end of this. He's in charge of the ranking points. The opposition need to get a hold of him. Good grab there from Hardwick. With a driving kick. Intercepts the ball well. Greenwood goes with the kick. Takes a simple grab. Silvani plays it on. Puts it on the boot. It'll be a ball up right near the boundary line. Thump clear. They can create from this. Gets it away. Got boot to ball. Finding the loose ball was May. Wins the race to the ball. Just puts it out in front. Has a runner alongside him. And the mark will be paid. Goes the long option. They chase after the loose ball. Him up, well, now it's a ball up. Oh, it's tense out there at the moment, Hutto. Phillips thumps it clear. Harms with clean hands for a difficult bouncing ball. Ends up with Gleason. Dale gets a quick kick away. Cripps marks. Offs the play on. Decides to kick. Takes an uncontested mark. 35 metres out. Miller launches towards goal. They'll be rolling that opportunity. Just two goals in it. Unsure of their next move. Decides to play on. Keeps the kick low. The loose ball picked up. Hands that ball to the opposition. We'll get a ball up. Phillips thumps it forward. Give. Down now. Might be in need of a rest. The mark has been taken. Keeps it moving. Receives the handball and takes off. Put his body on the line. Dale creates all sorts of problems for his opponents. Coaches love to see that kind of tackle. 
Hannon enjoying that goal. The margin is 14. We resume hostilities. Winning it was Phillips. Hurried kick. Hannon marks it. Moves it by foot. Gleeson found a way to mark that one. Slams it on the boot. A mark by Dale. Uses it by foot. The ball spells the Greenwood. That kick just beyond me. Western Bulldog. 40. Lead Adelaide. 25. Plays on from the kick in. Collected by McDonald. A strong mark in the pack for Greenwood. With a driving kick. Dangerfield did well to win that ball. Western Bulldogs have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of the game if they're to stay on top. Landed in his back on this occasion. Silvani looks to build some momentum with this kick. 25 metres out. Goes for the goals. What a goal! This kick puts them further into the lead. Get some reward for his efforts. Western Bulldogs could kick back-to-back -back goals. The margin is 21. He did really well there and gets the reward. That's a really good team goal. Adelaide could be winning enough of the ball to hit the scoreboard. If they're better with their efficiency, they can turn this around. Back in the middle to resume play. Swatson takes possession. Pretty lucky to get that free. Kick by Sinclair. Shields powers through the tackle. Cripps takes a strong mark. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. The Western Bulldogs forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Good mark and looks to send it back. The kick from Hannon. Finds a target. 35 metres out. Silvani drives with a goal. No issues with that drop pass. That's two now. Finding his feet in front of goals. Look at them celebrate that effort. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. The Crows have been controlling stoppages and lead the clearances. If they can clean up their ball use after the clearance, they can give themselves a chance. Back in the middle now. Thrashes it. Great control there. Harms is streaming past and gets the footy. Hoskinelli hacks it on the boot. Heaney short by hand. Found space for an easy mark. He drives it. Takes the mark all by himself. Moves it by foot. Cripps going for number one. He takes the mark. Western Bulldogs are allowing too many marks inside the opposition for 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Nice work for Dale. Uses it now. Cripps gets in a good position. Goes with the kick. Great mark. Big kick required from this distance. Okay. Miller going for number one. The drop punt sails between the big sticks. Congratulated by his teammates. Adelaide now only trailed by 21. We're back in the middle now. Punches are clear. Hits him hard. Picks it up. Shows some physicality. Contests the hard ball. He takes aim. The drop punt goes straight between the big sticks. 
Rosie celebrating hard. Western Bulldog lead by 27. Western Bulldog had the lead at three quarter time by 27. Western Bulldogs fans will be hoping they can hold on and get a memorable victory today. Here's Gary to take a look at the key stats. Adelaide needs to make the most of their chances inside 50. They aren't getting... We have one quarter of footy ahead of us. Let's go. They need to get a move on if they're going to win from here. Thrashes it. Controlled well off the bounce. Still going for number one. That one will really miss them. No doubt about it. About to resume hostilities. Thump by Grundy. He wins possession. Showing some really good pressure there. Shields takes it well. Advances through the tackle. Doesn't hold on to the mark. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's having a real quiet match, Hunter. Now we've got a ball up. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? I'd really love it if these teams took the contest to the next level. He looks like he needs a spell. He likes his chances from here. Hipwood celebrates with the fans. Western Bulldogs doing well at the moment. Grundy gets onto the ball. A clean collect. Looks up with the kick. Does well to cut off the kick. Western Bulldogs have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Green marks in a bit of space. Marks now can send it back. Wants to play on. Got boot to ball. Takes that one strongly. Looks to move it by foot. Good mark there. This will certainly test him from this distance. Going for goal number one. He slots this one. A big goal there. He celebrates hard after that. Adelaide reduced the margin. Hammers it. And now Miller uses the hands instead of the body. And it's a free kick. Miller elects to kick. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Wilson uses it by foot. A good mark under the circumstances. Western Bulldogs just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Oh, he did everything right except take the mark. Puts it on the boot. Spills the mark. Brand needs to lift. He's barely touched the ball there. The Crows behind by 20. Players move as they look to provide an option. They can just slow the game down now, take a bit of time off the clock. Decides to kick. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Maybe the coach needs to get on the phone to him and give him some instructions. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? There's not enough effort out there at the minute. Akers sends it into space. Fought hard to get a handball away. With the ball now. Hits the target by hand. Franklin clears the congestion. Spent that one before he earned it. It'll be a ball up. Phillips won the hit out. Sockers it forward. Narkel looking a bit sluggish out there. It's a behind. Would have loved to nail that chance. Western Bulldogs have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. It's why they're still in front. 
Nice hands. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. The Western Bulldogs' forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. A chance to put a second goal on the board. Nails the goal. He's enjoying that goal. That's two in a row for Adelaide. Margin within touching distance. Punched away. He's got the footy in his hands. Cotchen brings it out of the pack. Couldn't complete the mark. Hacking it out of there. Picked off by O'Brien. Hannon will be the recipient of the free. He takes the shot. That looked great. What a goal. Puts his second on the board. This one gives them a bigger lead. Hannon couldn't be happier with that goal. Umpire ready to resume play. Grundy just swats it away. Is in his possession. Moved on by Kerno. Knuckle got under it. Western Bulldogs haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Dangerfield with some fancy moves. Turned it over. Puts it into space. He gets his hands on the footy. Intercepted by Greenwood. Houston flicks it over. He's got the football now. Shields just manages to release the kick. And the ball rolls over the boundary. Ball over the boundary line. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? It's a really entertaining game of football. Couldn't keep the ball in play. Umpire tosses it in. Clears the contest. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. Gathers it now. Sees it out of play. The ball is coming back into play. Thump clear. Made the tricky bounce look easy. Moves the ball by foot. Sinclair hangs onto that one. Goes by foot. Doing well to intercept that kick. West off with a drilling ball. A solid mark from Franklin. Lining up from a 45 degree angle. He slams it towards goal. They are happy with that effort. Franklin getting the crowd involved. The Crows to within three goals now. About to resume play. Grundy hurls it away. And there it is. Western Bulldogs win, and their fans are certainly happy about it. I thought we saw one side capitalise on their chances and the other didn't. So often we see that determine the result. At the end of the game, the scores are Western Bulldogs 70, Adelaide 57. That's all for today.